Welcome along to Stamford Bridge as Chelsea aim to put the disappointment of a controversial Champions League draw at Real Madrid behind them with Liverpool, the visitors in the Barclays Women's Super League and for Sophie Ingle, a 184th WSL appearance today, a new league record in front of a five-figure crowd as Emma Hayside faced Matt Beard's team in West London. Charles... And now it's with Cuthbert to take a touch and let fly. Wasn't that far away. Did it take a deflection or was it Laws that managed to push that one over? Good strike nonetheless here. And that's a little loose in central midfield. And Chelsea managed to win it back. Ingle looking for Lauren James. Here is the England winger. And still going forward, wonderful finish. It is Chelsea that have the advantage. Well, Liverpool were slack in midfield and they have been punished here by Lauren James. Credit Ingle with the assist, but this is all about Lauren James. And they back away from the England superstar and that's a really good finish. Into the corner beyond Laws. Bonner backs off, and that always spells danger. Real precise finish with the left foot. And let's see how Liverpool respond here to going a goal down. This is van der Sanden. An awful lot of space to work with here, and still van der Sanden gets the cross in. Oh, it's an own goal, I think, Jess Carter. They were behind... For around about two minutes, Matt Bid's seem a back on terms here at Stamford Bridge. Van der Sanden with a really good run. She had so much space to work with here. She was onside. Flag stayed down correctly so. A positive and powerful run from Van der Sanden. And I think it is Jess Carter. It is indeed. It looked like a double touch as well here. She's a bit unlucky. She can't get her feet right. Van der Sanden's cross doesn't pick out a red shirt, but a blue one. But it's 1-1. Touch a fortune certainly about the equaliser, but Liverpool will not care. Kerr to take a touch, and she's got options here. One of them is James. It's deep towards Beaver Jones. Wonderful header. Midway through this first half, and Chelsea are back in front. Well, it's the combination play of Kerr and James and a deep cross here from Lauren James. Beaver Jones times her run to perfection and that's such a clever header. Just look at this. Takes the pace off it, almost nods it down. Really well done. This will be a better angle for us. Textbook stuff from Beaver Jones. Chelsea lead by two goals to one. on and now James well, they haven't learnt their lesson because they're backing away again it's James it's Laws with a save and she's furious the Liverpool keeper here and the defenders giving her little cover Laws to go long Nodded back with a bit of interest. Flick to the left-hand side and James from Kerr's ball. It's James! Wonderful hit! Well, that's better than her first. It's Chelsea's third. 11 minutes into this second half and Chelsea establishing control here against Liverpool. Kerr with the assist and James with the pinpoint shot into the corner, hit with power once again. And she's having a day all right. Technique is spot on. Liverpool under pressure. Flick through towards Kerr, and it's Kerr, and it's Law that makes the save. Well, the keeper's done well here because Kerr shaped to go one way, then went the other. It's clever. 
that Laws was two are equal. Victor Cabin to take a touch and still going forward. That's clever. Who can she find? Who else but Lauren James for the hat trick? A first Women's Super League treble for Lauren James, and it is thoroughly deserved. Johanna Rittinkanere doing really well on the right-hand side. Just look at this. Plenty of awareness here. The cut back, and then prods it in field. Well, James wanted that one. Perfectly timed run. Laws is beaten again, and Chelsea lead by four goals to one. And Lauren James really is having a day. Liverpool with a free kick. Plenty of red shirts inside the area. Oh, it's saved by Mushevich and cleared off the line by Perisic. Wonderful defensive work. Hauga, I think it was, with the header. And between them, the Chelsea keeper and defender managed to clear. Perisic on the line here. It's a good save initially. And then hooked to safety brilliantly. James. Takes the touch and then gets to the byline. Looks to get the cross in. It's cleared away. It's Ingle with the header. Cleared away by Bonner. Liverpool survived just. It was a header that was on target. Awkward. Taken down just about. Chelsea get the lucky bounce. Leeting counted it again on this right hand side. It's Nuskin from close range, could not miss. And Chelsea have a fifth. Well, the game was already over, but with 12 minutes remaining, it certainly is now. Suspicion of offside, but she's definitely the right side of the Liverpool rear guard as is that ball and it's the combination play again with another really good run on this right hand side Austin supplies the finish from close range that is full time and it's a comprehensive Chelsea success Emma Hayes' side in control for most of the fixture. Matt Beard's team could open far too often. The Blues far too good. And for Lauren James, the match ball, a hat-trick. Her first in the WSL as the Blues now go six points clear for now at the top of the league standings. It's finished here. Chelsea 5, Liverpool 1. How ruthless was this performance against the most improved team, in your words, today? Yeah, absolutely. What a team performance. Uh, three games, six days, six changes after midweek. Everyone in this team is playing such an important role. They're ready, starting, not starting, from game to game. There's no fuss. And that's what I'm loving the most about my team. Training hard, playing their part and puts us in great positions like today. And one other thing you must be loving is the youngers, all the early 20s in the, in the team, like Aggie, Aggie Beaver-Jones getting her goal, obviously Lauren Jones getting her hat-trick as well, and Shirka getting on the score sheet. It must be really exciting to see those young players really just showing what they can do on the pitch. No, absolutely, but we should make this about Sophie Ingle. 187 games, she's a record, uh, played the record number of games in, in WSL history. You need their wisdom, you need Mara Mielders, you need Sophie Ingles to be able to... Uh, offer you know their experience they're invaluable in what they're giving the team right now so big shout out to the older players finally let's talk about that the older players with the balance of the youngers in the group three games in six days how important is rotation I mean listen you you can't talk about value in every member of your team or your squad and you don't use the squad I've always used the squad and I think the difference from any other year I've been here is the level's really, really high amongst each and every player and they're a really good bunch, they care about each other, they're looking after each other in so many ways, so I'm just proud to be given the opportunity to coach such amazing people. 
Seven home wins in the WSL against Liverpool. You've ended Liverpool's unbeaten away run and you're six points clear at the top of the table. Tell me, how does that all sound, Marin, to you? It sounds really good, of course. Uh, we want to win every game we play and uh, after a, a tough week, we, we ended it with a good win today, a solid win. So really proud of the team and the performance today. You mentioned it's been a, a tough week. Liverpool are a, a tough team. So how, did you, how much discipline was needed today to deal with their press and physicality? We knew it was going to be a tough game today. Uh, Liverpool had started the season really well. Uh, so uh, we didn't have many days to prepare, only one day, really, um, after the late game against Madrid. So, But we're so, so professional. The girls are really professional. Everyone uh, knows what it takes to win. And I think uh, today was a really good performance. How good a tonic is it to get a result like this, 5-1 at the end of full time? Oh, it's uh, really good. You can just see... Uh, See, uh, like the first half, I think was uh, probably, yeah, it was tough for us. Uh, but then we just get better and better. We do changes, they get tired, and then we just keep going the whole time. And I think that's something uh, that has become like our character uh, that we we never give up and just still keep going. And I think we showed that today. Lauren James with the hat trick. Uh, Shirkanushin getting on the score sheet as well and Aggie get again she loves scoring doesn't she getting on the score sheet how wonderful is it to see those players just showing their flair on the pitch and also for you as a defender keeping a clean sheet so, so to speak yeah we we did concede one though but uh, no it's uh uh, it's really good to see uh, they're all young players as well and uh, the way they've been contributing this season is, is so good. It's good for us to know that we have uh, multiple goal scorers in the team uh, and that they all I think have four goals each now in the league. Uh, it's, it's wonderful, it's good to see.